The following is going to be a really quick video just letting people know about a little known secret in the vitamin industry that might shock you. This little known secret is that 95, maybe even more, percent of all vitamins on the market today are fake synthetic versions of real vitamins that have been made in a lab in order to save money. Now, big pharma and practitioners of conventional medicine will tell you that there is no difference between vitamins made in a lab and vitamins found in nature. However, in a natural form, a vitamin can be thought of as an egg that contains multiple different ingredients that are needed in order to make up that specific vitamin. Let's take vitamin C for example. Real non-synthetic vitamin C contains multiple essential ingredients that are needed to make a vitamin C. These are vitamin P, K, J, um, copper, and ascorbic acid. Now with synthetic vitamin C that's been made in a lab, the only ingredient within this is ascorbic acid. And it is commonly derived from GMO cornstarch and sulfuric acid. That sounds completely crazy, but it's 100% true. Now, without all of the other ingredients, synthetic vitamin C is not truly vitamin C, but companies could care less about our health because synthetic vitamins are extremely cheap to produce and are way more profitable compared to selling natural vitamins in their natural form. For example, here's a product on a popular site where vitamin and supplement companies go to purchase bulk orders of no-name generic ingredients and products straight from the manufacturer. As we can see here, this company which is based in China is selling bulk synthetic vitamin C, which is ascorbic acid, bulk ascorbic acid for around $250 to $5 per kilogram with a minimum order quantity of 25 kilograms, which is about 55 pounds. And that's only going to cost around $100 for 55 pounds of vitamins. So that's why they do this. It is extremely cheap. Um, here's another product from a manufacturer who's selling synthetic vitamin B12, which is cyanocobolamine. The real version is methylcobolamine. That's the version that you would want from vitamin B12. Now, this manufacturer has done over $1 million in transactions in the past six months. And you can pretty much guarantee that most of those transactions are from companies selling vitamins in North America. Without making this video too long, I will leave it here. As always, if you guys have found this information useful, please help us out by giving this video a like and subscribing to the channel.